Hello friends, welcome back to tutorials. In this tutorial, we will learn about NAND and NOR function. NAND is the complement of AND function and it is an abbreviation of NOT AND. This is the gate which implements this NAND function. Right. It is also called NAND gate. Here X and Y are the input of this gate right? and F is the output. Since f is the complement of uh, and function, so it can be written as the complement of x and y. Now it is the truth table for f. Now for uh, when the value of x and y is 0, then the value of function f would be 1. Right? And when the value of x and y is 1, the value of f would be 0. Now, this is the operator symbol for NAND function, right? Now, first we NAND x and y, right? Then whatever result we get, we NAND it with binary variable z. Here x and y are also binary variable. So, the result of x and y would be the complement of x and y. Now, it, now it has to be nanded with binary variable z. So, it would become the complement of, complement of x and y and z. Then by De Morgan's theorem, it would become the complement of, complement of, x and y that is equal to x and y plus z complement now look at here here what we have to do first we have to nand y and z and then we will nand the result of y and z with binary variable x so the result of y nand z is complement of y and z right now it is to be nanded with binary variable x. So it would become complement of x and complement of yz. And uh, by De Morgan's theorem, it would be equal to x complement plus complement of complement of y and z. That is y and z, right? So it is equal to x complement plus yz. Now, these two results are not equal, right? It means NAND function is not associative. Now, it is a NAND gate which has three inputs, right? x y and z then the output would be then uh, uh, here the output is represented by f then the output would be x nand y nand z which means the complement of x and y and z now nor function it is an abbreviation of not all function, right? It is the complement of or function. So it is an abbreviation of not or. Now this gate is called nor gate and this nor gate implements the nor function, right? Here x and y are the inputs of this gate and f is the output. Since uh, nor function is not or function, that is complement of or, right? So f would be equal to the complement of x or y, that is x plus y, complement of x plus y. 
Now it is the operator symbol of nor function and it is now this is the truth table of nor function right its uh, value would be 1 if and only if both inputs are 0 right if both binding variables x and y are 0 because it is the complement of OR function. Now, the NOR function is not associative. That is, if we evaluate NOR for X and Y first and then the result of X NOR Y is NOR with Z is not equal to when x is not with the result of y nor z. Now when the nor gate has three inputs then its output would be x nor y nor z that is its output would be the complement of x or y or Z. Right. Thank you very much.